Hello and welcome again to Nashua Community College's Precision Manufacturing Lab. My name is Professor Howe. Today we're going to learn how to upload a file to a Haas CNC mini mill. The machine's already been started up and sent to home and we've also inserted our thumb drive into the machine control. What do we want to do? We want to hit the list program button here down on the left. As we hit list programs, we'll see three tabs, memory, USB, and hard drive. We're going to arrow up to the memory. You'll see that it turns red, the text does. We're going to go to the right to USB. Now, in order for the machine to upload or to view the files on your USB, we're going to hit the enter button. This particular USB only has one program on it. I'm going to use my pulse hand wheel to get down there. I can also use my cursor to access that file. So it's highlighted in yellow. What we're going to do is we're going to hit the enter button and we're going to hit the F2 button. And a little uh, menu comes up and says, where do you want us to copy it to? And I want to copy it to the memory, which is already highlighted. So I will hit the enter button. And if we look here under memory on the blue side on the left, you'll see that our program, known as plate one, is indeed ready to use. One should note that all the programs for the Haas should begin with the capital letter O. And it's helpful if you eliminate or don't use the 9000 series numbers as they are guarded in the Haas control. Now, if I want to graphically run this program, I'm going to use the memory button and I'm going to select setting graphic button. I'm going to hit that two times. You see the white screen comes up in graphics mode. Now we are safe to use cycle start to run our program graphically. Nothing will happen inside the machine. If we're satisfied, great. If we need to make some changes, we certainly can do that by changing the, the G-code, or we can go back to Mastercam or some other software. Once we've done what we want to do with our program, we would come back to list program so that we can empty it or remove it from the memory. We will use the arrow key on the cursor to go up and then over to turn memory back to red, and we would hit the enter button. That gives us a list of programs in the memory. So either the cursor or the arrow button, as we arrow down to our program, which happens to be 000311, we see that there's a small A there. The A is there, meaning the program is active. And we are not able to, er to erase an active program. So if I cursor up to some other program and I hit the select program button, you'll see that the A will move. Now I can cursor back down to the program I want to erase and I'm going to hit the erase program button. And it asks me if I am sure and I say Y for yes. And that's a simple walkthrough of how we can load and erase a program on a CNC milling machine built by the fine people at Haas. Thanks for watching.